it's been a real honor today to talk about uh, being a past president of Rotary. You know, it's a, it's a great honor. It's a great responsibility. Uh, one of the honors I felt is uh, I was the second youngest Rotarian president by six months uh, ever in the history of our club. I also felt honored that my brother and my dad have both been presidents of Rotary Club. So that's, that's part of the honors of it. Um, my year was, uh, my goal that year really was to have all committees be engaged. And, and the way we did that was at each board meeting, we, we had two or three committee chairs come to each board member to tell us what was going on. And that was just kind of a, a, our way of making sure that each committee was involved because we have so many committees. And, and when you are on a committee, uh, it's important that they're involved. And so we felt really good that we had basically probably almost 100% of the committees accomplishing something that year. So that was a big plus. I just want to take a minute and go and talk about being the first president of the Acoma Trust. So that, that was probably one of the most exciting things I've ever done. Uh, we had five members of, our, of the Rotary Trust originally. We had $250,000. And with that money, we were able to partnership with Lions, Kiwanis, the city, uh, and the state, and YBC. And we were able to put in those fields that you see down at the Kiwanis Park. And from that project, you can see what's happened. And I just invite you all to go down and look at that area. None, we certainly did not plan to have additional softball fields. We didn't plan on the skate park. We didn't plan on the playgrounds. We didn't plan on, the, on all the new apartments that have gone in there. That was probably one of the worst areas in our community. Uh, it was just a horrible looking place and it was a very dangerous place. So when you go through there and look at what's happened from one little project with $250,000, it's amazing. And what we did, we used skills from all different types of Rotarians to help us through the legal issues, buying the properties and everything else. So take some great pride and just drive through that area and say that was a seed that Rotary planted that just did wonderful things for that part of the community. So it's been an honor to be a past president of Rotary. And I have to say one disappointment this year is that Rotary, uh, Eric did great planning, has great passion, and his performance has been phenomenal. I'm very disappointed that he couldn't finish this year uh, with a live audience, but Eric, you deserve a great, great credit. It's been a great year, and it's great, been a great part of welcoming you to the Past President Club in about three months. Thank you, guys.